To be sure of my theory, I need to bring up a beast that's clearly capable of engulfing a limb. I have to attempt one more catch with what's left of my tackle. I might be about to get more than I bargained for. This is a good size fish. Let's get well clear of the line. The beast isn't a heavyweight red tail, but a hundred pound plus piraiba. This goes to show that these pristine waters aren't patrolled by just one type of giant predatory catfish, but two, and both were found at Obidos. But there's a problem. The hook has been taken deep inside the mouth, and I need to take it out. I'm going to shove my hand in to get the hook out. It's going to give me a bite. It's bitten my arm. But this extreme opportunity to feel the bite of a big catfish gives me the last piece of evidence I need. Piraiba are in the same family as red tails and they have virtually identical rasping pads in their mouths. These give them a grip that prevents slippery, struggling prey from escaping. A grip far superior to human hands. And a grip that I now know would have no problem holding struggling prey in the dark waters of Obidos the night the boat went down. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like the River Monsters page.